Cornucopius is the best triple A rated game built on Unreal Engine 5. And I am proud to say that we have just got access here to be testing. We had to refresh our roles. There were some upgrades. The file nodes came out. We're gonna look at the Cornucopius account, how you can get involved, how exciting it is for me. You're gonna see me be super excited about this. It's a long time in the making. I had to get another computer to do the testing because I normally have a Mac and so you needed a Windows. I'm gonna talk about that. And then in real time, my son and I just went through updating that computer, downloading Cornucopia's launcher, and we played for the first time ever in the game as a tester. And you'll see that I just started to take video with my phone. So it's kind of crude, but I think you'll enjoy it. If you like that footage, say in the comments that you would like us to do some screen share videos with the Cornucopius game actually as we walk around that metaverse and look at hollow catches and look for all kinds of stuff because it is fun, there's racing. And so let me just show you Cornucopius. It is an amazing ecosystem. It's amazing project built by amazing people. If you haven't watched a Kopi Cafe, please watch some Kopi Cafes. And without any further ado, let's go to our Cornucopius account and I'll show you what I'm talking about. Okay, so here's the Cornucopius website. This is how you get to your account. I already have my account clicked in and we're gonna move over to our account. But this is the official website, cornucopius.io, where you can check out everything about how to play and all that. And we're gonna go into the overview of our account. And look at this, we have finally qualified for testing. And this has something to do with the fact that I have another computer. You cannot play unless you have a Windows computer. I will show you if you click how to play. They are coming out with Macs, not soon, but they will have compatibility with like every computer out there. But right now Windows is like the, gold, the golden standard for gaming. Uh, okay, so who can play? Yeah, qualifying game and assets and NFTs. So you can have the vehicle rarities, the bubble jets, these are all the vehicles that are out and land rarity, uh, deeds and domes. And so this is, this is the, the, the important um, feature, supported GPUs. Okay, and, and then it's just super easy. You create a player account, you click the register, you can link your wallet and your game assets. This is all the steps you need to take. You have to wait for your roles to update. Um, we just had to all refresh our roles and relink our wallets. And that's what I had to do on the other computer. And it is awesome. It is so exciting, um, to actually be a tester. And so we, yeah, we'll show you a little bit of that crude content a little bit, but here's the public testing. We're in the Kopi wiki. Now there are, this is pretty much their resource for everything you need to know about cornucopius. And it's like their white paper. It's everything. And here are the uh, current testing PC laptop requirements. And I am fortunate, I live outside of Philadelphia where we do have a micro center, but you can call micro center, you can go to any computer store like Best Buy, I don't think Best Buys are still open around where you are. But most Windows computers are going, you're gonna, you're just, a, if you don't know anything about this, like me, like I gotta know anything about this, I just kind of took this, I. Uh, actually took a, took a little video from my phone, brought it in there, and the guys there were able to help me out right away. So these are like the, the cards that you need. Um, and you can just roll down there. And once you have that in play and your NFT, where can you get an NFT? Let's show you, because we're packing, we're packing these videos with content. JPG store, right there, JPG store. Uh, you go to Cornucopius. Okay, here are the land sales. There are the custom domes. Here are uh, bubble jets, right? Bubble jet javelins. And these are the some of the NFTs. And so like if you wanted to, uh, for instance, get a bubble jet sprinter, you could get one now for 70 ADA. Now they are ranked differently. Like this one's a common CM. There's common, there's uncommon, there's rare, there is legendary, and there is mythic. If you want, um, you can go over here and toggle rarity and just click, I wanna, you know, how much are the mythics? They're gonna be a lot. Actually, not that, the 2200 ADA. So that's a lot, that's the, that's the cheapest one. They go up and up and up in price, and look, there's not that many, okay? So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, that's it. That's all there are. 
the mythics. And okay, that's just, this, is, this is just how you find, like you can get some of these NFTs into your wallet. Okay, register that wallet. You could link that wallet. Uh, you can get a land plot, 178 ADA, boom, you're in. You know, you're in the game. You can get, there are copious land plots that are huge. These are the biggest land plots that you can get. Okay, the cheapest one right now, 5,999. And there's not many of these, I would suspect. There's not many of these available. Look, that's it. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, there's 15 of these available. I mean, seriously, there's not that many. When you go into small or like large, for instance, you know, there's gonna be a lot for sale. All right, you're gonna come down here, look. See, all these are for sale. There's gonna be even more mediums for sale and more smalls, okay? So there's a lot of land plots for sale at different um, price points and different size points. But just to get in the game, okay, and to have some land, you can get in there, okay? You can get in, okay? It's not bad at all. Just gonna show you that real quick. We're gonna go back to... We're gonna, we're gonna exit that out. We're gonna go back to our uh, account. Okay. And we're gonna go into our profile. Let's see my in-game assets. We got in-game assets. So we have been accumulating you know, in-game assets for a long time. We have 54 of them. Uh, we have some bubble jets. We got the OG. We got one of these OG guys. Yep, we got the OG. You got the Bonanza. We got the Javelin. There's not much we don't have because I'm participating in the mints also. So what is a mint? A mint is when if something first comes out, you can take part. You can take part. I actually did a video on that. Gosh, it must be like two years ago, maybe now. We did a video where we minted in real time. Maybe we'll put this up in the corner so you can see. So you can believe me. We did, we did a mint on, on some land. We got land. I mean, we, we got land and then you can take advantage of doing the trees. Um, and all this ha have opportunities. And so we have some, you know, it, it just, and then it shows you your rarity, uh, how many mythics or legendaries or commons you have. Okay, so it's just a pretty exciting. This, this sort of tracks what you have. Um, and then the node sale, the node sale went off uh, without a hitch. It was really nice. We've been acquiring uh, nodes. And so you, if, you, if you have a node right now and you have not registered the node, you need to register the node this month, okay? You have all month of July. You have the whole month of July to register your nodes. It is the simplest registration. All you do is literally, they're all registered, but you just click the button register. It, it, this button will say register and you just click it and it registers it, nothing else. There's no transaction fee. There's nothing you need to sign. Um, and so, yeah, we have a total of 11 nodes and for every node that you have to gain rewards, um, you need to have 5,000 ADA in your wallet per node up to three nodes. Once you pass three nodes, you just need to have that 15,000 ADA required, okay? So that's what we have. We have 15,000, we have over 15,000 uh, corn, excuse me, I just said ADA, copy, 15,000 copy in your wallet to then get rewards. And we're gonna see, I'm gonna check back on this uh, in August 1st which is three, three weeks away, something like that, we're gonna start getting rewards because we have these nodes. Um, and so that's exciting. So, you got, so we got these nodes. And what are nodes? Nodes are really exciting because they are a way for Cornucopius to decentralize and distribute the processing and the in-game um, processing, right? And I'm being really, um, general as I speak here because it's extremely technical and what for for individuals that are going to be running these nodes it really helps out the Cornucopius project run the entirety of the game in real time because it's a costly endeavor it's it costs a lot to actually run the game like that and so they're breaking it up into these file nodes and there are going to be node operators. You can be a node operator, right? Or you could just get some of these nodes and register them and then delegate them to a node operator. And for that, because you are doing that, and Cornucopius is appreciative of that, they are going to reward you with Copy tokens. And so we're gonna be getting Copy tokens for that, which is exciting. Plus, we're a part of helping the 
game. We're a part of helping the ecosystem. And Cornucopias is a project that I love to help. I love to help them do everything I can to help them. They're fantastic. I watch every single Copia Cafe. It's a really wonderful time. You know, what are you drinking? What am I drinking? What am I drinking right now? I am drinking a coffee. It's actually, it's actually half mushroom coffee. You know, the mushroom phase. Uh, I got a, I got a bag of this. It's good. It's not the best, but it's healthy. It makes me feel good. So that's what I'm drinking today. Cheers, Rob and uh, Josh there. You know, cheers, cheers, cheers to the coffee. Um, and we're going to go into, let's go into settings. This is where you will see your roles. Um, ba -bum. and maybe we'll, this goes into the settings. So here are the wallets. So you can just add wallets. So currently I have four wallets right here and involved that have different assets that have different NFTs that are participating in different stake pools. Some are in the Kopi stake pool. Some are in the Copic stake pool. And so some of them have different um, purposes and NFTs. And what I love about this is it aggregates all of those wallets and registers all of those NFTs and gives me all of the roles. And so here are my roles. We got roles. We are the rare holder. We're a Copi delegator. We're, we have rare access, legendary holder, mythic access, uncommon access, launcher access, legendary. Woohoo, we got some great roles. It's exciting. Ah, it's exciting. You can refresh the roles. Like if you link a wallet, if you link a new wallet, you could refresh the role and then boom. Um, you know, you have to wait, wait a while. Okay. And then you will have that going on. So if I go back over to overview, we will go back here and here we are on our main page. Yeah, I'm proud to say that we've been a member here. Like I've officially became a member within the, this exact uh, forum on December 9th, 2023. And we have the pre-alpha access. You know, we got the desktop launcher. Great news. Great news. Your account is now eligible to access our game launcher. If you're using a Windows PC, simply navigate to the website header where you'll find a download button. Did all that. A little bit of, a little bit of like finagling, but... It's so simple. It's so easy. It's exciting. We have access now to the, to the game testing and yeah. Okay. So I'll show you right now. Uh, my son and I got into it because my son's 14 going into high school next year. He's going to be a ninth grader. He is really uh, smart with this kind of thing. And we've been talking about how we can approach cornucopias coming up and he's good at gaming way more than I am. And so we actually watch Formula One. There's a Formula One show on Netflix. And uh, he actually went to the racing game. He said he applied a little bit of what we've been watching and, and just, just learning through osmosis when you watch something from Formula One into, into the racing game, which is incredible, the racing. And so it was his first time racing. You know, I'm just sitting here with my, with my cell phone videotaping the computer. So it's not like it's a screen share, but I think it's cool. Uh, tell me what you think. And if you want us to do screen share videos, sh t tell us that too, because we'll put that video out there. We'll put those videos out for you guys. And once we figure out how to screen share on that windows and show you the inside copy, copy scoops, because we've been hitting up the hollow caches. We've shown them where they are. Uh, and it's so exciting. And even last night when we got on there, we met another person. We actually saw another person that might have been testing, that was testing also. And we were able to wave to them. And that was really exciting. Okay, so check it out. And we'll see you guys soon. Here we are witnessing the Cornucopia's launcher finally launching. It's been a long time. Had to get this new computer, had to get a Windows computer, had to refresh the rolls, re-sync the wallets. And now we have finally gained access to play and we're excited about it at 99%. 99%. Are you excited? Yeah. You're excited you're gonna race? Yeah. We're gonna race, we're gonna find the land out. We're going to orient ourselves with the land. We're going to see what the land is all about so we can get in that land grab. That's going to be fun and redeem our deeds. Give us a full view. 100%. It says 
Uh oh. Uh oh. Launch. Yeah. All right. Do you want to do the honors? Sure. Should I do it with the mouse? Yeah. The mouse. All right. We're gonna check these licenses and terms and come right back at okay. you. We, today's a big day. We did it. We finally did it, didn't we? You wanna edit the camera? Duke, this is where you just have to like, this is where you are going to. Oh my God. Dude, this is crazy. Yo. Oh my goodness. Make him buff. Get the bottom shit. Yo. That's let's so like uh let's do one like like with us, like who we are. Yeah, so let's try to Should I do you? You got a big chest. Alright. Uh, Wait, let's go to face. Wow, these are so like It's the it's the most intricate Avatar creator in the world. Dude, I don't even know. It's the most intricate avatar creator out right now. Skin. Cheers. <laughs> I'm just cheers in the audience. Courage is being scared to death, but saddling up anyway. This is this is like three years in the making. Three years from an ISPO to supporting the project and minting the trees to minting the land, minting the vehicles, holding on strong. Talking about diamond cutter hands. We'll do. I saw one that kind of represented us. There you go. That's cool. This one looks good. Skin. There's like freckles. That's like, you know, we're not really freckled. <laughs> Clothing. They just have body suits. Yo, what? <laughs> That's cool. That's super cool. That's cool. Should we save? Yeah, let's just save it. Main menu? Oh my gosh. Let's go to like... Dang, dude. So we could play right now. Go to assets or something? Is that... Okay. It's not really registered. Go to like play, dude. Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. Yo, no, look is, at that. This is different. <laughs> You're talking about the most premier AAA rated game built on Unreal Engine 5. And it's MVP. We're literally launch testers right now, July 10th, 2024. That's the racetrack. That is the racetrack. <laughs> oh, that's so <laughs> sick. Yo. <laughs> oh, we're in. Yo, we are in. Oh my god, dude. We are in. Yo, this is crazy. <laughs> Burrito boss. <laughs> oh my gosh. Toledo Valley. Guess we just gotta go down. Yeah. What is this? Yo, this is cool. 
Tropy Cola. Tropy Cola. <laughs> that is so sick. Wow. I wonder how you even, like there's probably a way to draw up the map. That thing moves. That thing freaking moves. Catch a ride on that. What was that thing and how did you, how do you even get to it? What? We can loot things? Wow. Now we got a burrito and a Coca-Cola. <laughs> so, what is this? I have no idea. I, I don't know. I literally don't know anything. You, you could probably move to the side. Like you could move the screen. But maybe not. Okay. Wait, is E for inventory is that? Wow, so you could loot that there. That's like somewhere on the other side. Eyes for inventory. Brood of boss, death by meat. No, it's enjoy. Industrial. Needs for crafting. We got something that we can craft. Awesome. So how can we hitch a ride on this thing? Can we jump? Oh, see, he's also running to it. We can. <laughs> Your plane's taking off. Wait, is this something that takes you up? Yeah, like, look up. Can you look up or around? I mean, so, yeah, there you go. Oh. We're on it. You're on it. get into the land did we do we say we wanted to go into Kalito Valley because maybe you could select to go to Solace that's where I want to that's where we need to go for land whoa <laughs> welcome to Kalito Valley Kalito Metro okay Go down there. Yeah, go down there. Solace. Did you see that? Yeah, Solace. It's like parking garages. A glimpse of Solace. That's cool. It's so dark because it's at nighttime. Yeah. Oh. Um. Please watch your step. Should the metro come? Thank you for riding Kalido Metro. <sighs> Yo. We just missed it, but I think because just wait. There. Yeah, it's coming. Let's just wait. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is cool. We just found the Kalido Race Valley Raceway <laughs> entrance, <laughs> and we're about to race. Oh my gosh. Oh wow! What I, the heck? How did you find it? I that's went, the place right there where that yeah. mythic thing was that we're trying to get. Um, I'll bet you some of these pictures have clues, because like that has the mythic in it, but you yeah. wouldn't even. Yeah, you wouldn't even know. I went into the Kalito Valley Grand Hotel. Okay. And as you enter it, like right around this corner, it will be there. It's like this big entrance, and there's six elevators that you can enter and go to this valley raceway then you'll have to keep continuing until you get this little port like this kind of like hub with a bunch mm -hmm. of screens where you can click on it and pick your vehicle Gosh. that you have and so then we're about that race press ready and race away dude this is this is surreal next race in a minute that is so cool Oh, cool. So there's like a countdown there. Next race in 56 seconds. 
let's go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> First time ever racing. Yeah. So what are the controls? <laughs> it's probably WASD. Like normal. So awesome. Yo, this is freaking cool. Oh my gosh. 30 seconds to the race. 30. So were you able to choose any of those vehicles? Yeah. For testing? Because we got the access. That's great. I think I picked our Mythic GTI Javelin. Okay. I think. Dude. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one. Oh wow. Okay. What? Okay. <laughs> oh. oh my gosh. Wow, so those are all the controls, huh? Yeah, that's for, huh, that's for, um, uh, uh, controller. Oops. <laughs> cool. Is it difficult? No, it, it's just hard to turn when you're moving super fast. Oh my god, I'm testing this. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> LT looks like brake. That's on my controller. Oh really? This would be brake. Oh, okay. Alright, let's try no crashing.
looks like the sun is starting to come up a little dawn. <laughs> okay, so your fastest lap was 1.17 and the fastest time was 4. Dang. This pump. That is so cool. Found a person. You literally found a person. Probably fist bumps. That is so cool, we're like interacting. Awesome. She's like, she's, she's like, like what's, I don't have to do. You could like follow her out with her. You just go your own way. Wow. Oh. Like That's not one. one. They would show something up there. That's cool, we met another person. <laughs> we did. <laughs> that was awesome. Two loan toasters. It's cool that you shook hands and like waved. It's awesome. Yeah, we fist bump. So B is to fist bump on a computer. All right, now we're gonna go to the racing. Oh wait, you are, we can please track selection. Okay, I'm gonna do the, this one because we haven't if we haven't done that one. Or have questions about our services, um, let's do the one that I'm good at. What did I pick? I picked the javelin. Here. So these are all these are all the NFT yeah. vehicles, and you're just selecting right from it because you're hooked into that. So I'll do this one. Yeah. Wow. 
five base games.
So that was a sneak peek into the Cornucopius Metaverse, where we're in Kalito Valley, we're in the racetrack, little sneak peek out into what is to come. The graphics are incredible. I can't tell you how unjust it looks from that video taken by my cell phone and how it really looks on the computer. It is mesmerizing. The sounds, the music, the lighting, the shading, the reflections, the clouds, it is incredible. I mean, it's unreal Engine 5. It's like unreal, right? AAA rated game. They are coming out. They're about to market to mainstream gamers soon. I would say towards the end of this year, if you follow the Kopi Cafes and you look at it, you'll see that they have some exciting things coming. Uh, so there's no better time for you than right now to get involved in Cornucopius in some way, shape, or form. Just get into Discord and check out their Discord. Become a part of it. Become a member. It's super easy. Say hi to the team. Consider going to JPG store, looking at what it's like to challenge yourself, to look at some of the land plots. Okay, you don't have to do anything, but it's exciting. It's exciting times. It's an exciting time right now in the in the world of Cornucopius. We're super early. The game isn't out yet. And wow, there's so much, so much to come. Okay, so thanks for watching. We'll see you in another video soon. Cheers.